Hi guys! So today is going to be a video about... It's going to be a haul because um, I just came home from Oslo with my friends uh, Reka and Ole. So I'm gonna show you how... I, how? I'm gonna show you what I bought and also uh, I bought a lot of extensions today so uh, the ones of you who were like wondering about that can get a little update right now. So first the not so excited exciting part but it's from H&M. Uh, first I found this. I always wanted like those uh, high short long short skirts. I don't know. But they're whenever I find them there's they're always like a size 42 and stuff and I need a size 34 so but here it is uh, it's a long short skirt it's long in the back and short at the front and you can choose between having this high-waisted or not I'm going to hide this have this high-waisted because then the short part gets way shorter I like it so those were uh, 150 crowners and now over to the next thing I bought at H&M is these pants. Pants. They're just no normal pants like these and yeah I like them and they make my legs really long and they were on sale on uh, half off. So it's a hundred crowners and that's always nice. And I have been looking at something like this, but they always look bad. But these one were really nice, so happy for that. So now over to the exciting part. <laughs> um, I also bought a lot of extensions. I bought more than I need and more than I, kind of more than I plan to. But uh, yeah, so where I got it is from this store called Bobbies. They do have a, an internet uh, a web page, but that sucks a bit. And a hair extension is really hard to like pick out on in the internet because the weight and the length and the feel of it and the color is always hard to like pick the right one. So I, uh, if you have the chance to go see the color face to face or go to the store you should obviously always do that but here is the address and it's a Norwegian page but I, I will link that down below in the description bar so first to the not that exciting part but I thought I was going to tell you for a while now I've been making these which are dreads as you can see uh, I have a video on how to how I make make this if you want to see and it's half purple and blonde and on the top it's blonde and then it kind of goes around and around and around and gets purple at the end. When I made this I didn't have enough I have to had to make more make more so I bought more hair for that and for that you need uh, something called canico. Is that how I pronounce it? I can show you that word. Well, so this is one of the packs. This is the purple one. I don't know if it shows off too well, but as you can see, it's kind of braided. And it's uh, like folded at top, so this is not the whole length. It's kind of double as this, but if you have seen in one of my videos, I am showing you this. So I also got the blonde color and these are really cheap this is 50 crowners and this is 75 i think 85 so it's just a little over 100 together and that's really cheap and you can do so much with them but i am making dreads as you can see on this picture up here so that's what these are for so now to the color extensions when I got there, I was going to buy one pair of blonde, black, purple, and blue in synthetic hair because I don't like... Well, I like human hair, but it's way more expensive, so... I got uh, blue, 
here. This is it's from the brand Sleek, I think. Yeah, Sleek is the brand. Performs like human hair. And the color is blue. What a surprise. Uh, and the length is 18. I think that is uh, inches. I don't know, but it's 18. Uh, it doesn't say anything about the weight, but I can show it to you because I am going to try it now anyways. And this has clips on it, so they're like clipping hair extension. Here it is. So, uh, if you're wondering how much you'll need, uh, in my hair now I got two packs. But the thing is that both of these are really, really messed up. They're both uh, probably between a year and half a year old. And that is old. You should not use extensions for that long. And at least not when it's synthetic. Then you should buy new ones in like a few months. But I don't care. Like the hair kind of falls off. So it's not as much hair in these as it is in this one. So maybe you'll get off with just one. But I guess you'll have to like try it out and stuff. But... Yeah, so this is the same one as this pink that I have in here. And at the beginning, it's so, so soft. But in a few days or months, it will get, like, more and more and more and more, like, not soft. But uh, that happens to all, so I don't think that's really bad because it's, it is pretty good extensions. So I recommend these uh, by Chic. And here you can see the length of it and the clips on the top. So they're like fit kind of here and then they go all the way down there. So now to the colors and types of the brands or something that I never used, okay? I wanted blonde hair because my hair is naturally blonde. So I wanted something to blend with, if you know what I mean. So if you have like blonde hair and you want pink hair and but you don't want to color it you should buy pink and blonde extensions because then you can mix them up and it will look more natural than just pink uh, I have that now but these are fucked up so that's why I wanted new ones but I was kind of tired of pink so I didn't buy pink which I probably should have done but here you can see them out of the package so these ones are curled, but you can obviously uh, straighten them, even though they're synthetic. You can always straighten and flatten and whatever you want, but just make sure that you don't hold it at the same place for too long. And when you're flattening it, you're when you straighten it, you don't do that any anyway. But when you curl it, be just a little bit careful, but it just to brush it out. If it does look like it's melting, it's not dangerous, just brush it out and then it's good as new. Here is it. The brand is also chic. The same as the blue ones. But these are in the color 613 and the uh, 20 inches long. So they're a bit longer than the uh, blue ones but not that much. And here you have the clips at the top. I want to take it out, I want to take it out, I want to take it out. Here you have it, or all curled up. And this you can always brush out, it's just... So it will stay intact in the box, you know. And these are, they're soft, but they're not soft as at the same way. Because these feel kind of a bit oily. They are really nice though, I like them. I like them. So oh, the next package is the same as the last curled one but in black. The brand is Chic and it's called Fashion Idol 101 which is just the same as uh, the two other extensions that I bought. But this one is in black. This is also uh, 20 inches long. And the color is 1. Okay, that was easy. It's 1. And here you can see it. It, it, it doesn't really show up as well on the camera because it is black and other people who had filmed black stuff maybe know what I mean it's not that easy 
here they are. They are basically just the same as the uh, as the red one, no, as the pink, as the blonde ones, but in black. And this is a really, really nice dark black. And I hate the black ones with which when you get like light on them, they shining off another color and especially blue i hate that i like it to be like totally black so i'm looking forward to try out these i don't i can't tell you uh how they work and how they fade in time if you know what i mean because i haven't used them but i will do an updated version version in like one month or something and here is just two pictures of uh, how the two colors work together as I am going to do it. Uh, first one is when I straighten it out and not in my hair. And, and the second one is before I straighten it out and then they're also in my hair. And they look great from behind as you can see but from the front it looks more like a bird's nest but... So that's why I straightened them out. And last but not least, these are also extensions. Uh, these are by a, by a different brand called Jassy up there. So this is blonde, but this is a very, very light blonde. It doesn't fit with my hair color at all, so why did I buy it? Well, it was to blend and to have highlights in my hair. And here they are. Oh, here they are out of the plastic looking really really nice so the color is KB88 and the length is I don't know it doesn't say the length on this it's the same length as the, as the blue ones uh, this is not as much hair as the blue ones and also they don't have clippings at the top because uh, it you're supposed to like sewing them by yourself and what I'm going to do is I am going to glue into my head so I'm going to take off these clips on the top here and sew them on to this one so so I can put this in whenever I want and I think that was a really good idea and I only bought this because my friend Reka which was with me as you know uh, she bought this uh, and then I was like, oh, I want to buy them. And my boyfriend was like, dude, you're going to regret it if you don't buy them. Because I'm not that often in Oslo. It costs 200 crowners to get like back and forth. And for me that doesn't have a lot of money, that is pretty expensive. So really, really light color here. So that was all for today. And again, all of these were from this Bobby's hair extensions. I'm going to link the link. I'm going to link the link. I'm gonna put the a bit. I'm gonna put the link down below uh, so you can check out what they got. It's not a really good uh, web page, but you can look at it if you want to. By the way, all of these cost about 300 kroners, and that's not expensive. And again, like uh, in the time between Christmas and New Year's, they had like 30% off on everything. That's nice. But that was all. Comment down below. Tell me if you like these. Tell me if you have tried them before. And tell me what you think about them. Uh, you can also like me on Facebook. Which is a link down below. Together with the link to Bobbix, Bobbix, to Bobby's hair extensions. You can also subscribe to my channel. That would be really nice. And bye guys. Love you all.